Hi, welcome to KJ and Tony Move to France. In today's video, we're sharing with you our apartment tour of our new apartment in Versailles. We're also going to be sharing some of the sites of the town with you that we've discovered since we've been here. You ready? I'm ready. Let's go. All right, let's go. Okay, we start with the three flights of stairs. We've saved one flight, but only two steps. Come on up.
right, are you ready to come in and see the kitchen that we have here in Versailles? It's much bigger, as I'm sure you can already tell, than the kitchen that we had in Paris. Tony has been sick just about since we've gotten here. He's getting better though. Uh, he just had a really bad, has had a really bad head cold, but he's getting better. I'm making him some beef stew tonight. My Grandpa Jack's famous beef stew. So this is the first that I'm cooking in this apartment. So let's go in and take a look. Come on in. There's a nice window where we get a lot of natural light in the daytime. I'm filming this obviously at night. I added all of the flowers because <laughs> I like to have touches of my own personal style and it's Christmas time. We're going to be spending Christmas here. So I wanted to have touches of Christmas around so that is there and then I also have a little flower over there. I love flowers so I love to have flowers all around the house. There's one of those warming racks right here, <laughs> right here in the kitchen, the one that you normally see in the bathroom and we do have one in the bathroom as you'll see but we also have one in the kitchen which I guess maybe is to dry like hand towels and things on. I'm not sure. This is our little coffee bar. And there's the microwave. There's lots of storage here in this kitchen. There's storage down there. We also have a dishwasher right there, which we did not have in Paris. And then nice counter space, nice big sink. This over here where you see this big plant sitting, there's actually a garbage underneath there. That garbage, it took me forever <laughs> to find where the garbage was when we first got here. And I finally found it here. So let me, let me show it to you. So this is what's underneath my flower pot. And then you open it. And it doesn't have the bucket in there right now, but there's a bucket that goes in there. And then you put the garbage bag in the bucket I'm just so used to the American <laughs> classic underneath the sink, so I'm not going to show it to you, but our garbage is there underneath the sink. And then, of course, we have the lovely stove top here with an oven. And here's the fridge. If you can see, there's a top fridge. fridge and there's also a freezer on the bottom which we're not currently using and there is this step stool that they left us here because the count the uh, cabinets are so tall they're super tall so to be able to get anything like there's a ton of cabinet space here but it's for a giant <laughs> so they have this step stool that you can use and so this is you know they they do provide you with silverware and things like that and plates which most Airbnb places do. And this is where the pots, the one pot that I'm using was located. So that's it for the kitchen tour. I hope you enjoyed it. So we hope you enjoyed that tour of our apartment here in Versailles. So how are you feeling about being here in Versailles, Tony? I like Versailles, it's got a lot of charm, but it's not Paris and it would be unfair to compare it to Paris. It's got a lot of history behind it um, and it's beautiful. The palace is spectacular, not just in its size, but it's in its grandeur. We can't uh, wait to bring it to you. Yeah, we'll be bringing it to you soon. And to be honest, I would prefer to be living in Paris than living in Versailles, but because we could not find a two bedroom within our price range, Versailles is the next best choice. And I am enjoying being in Versailles. It's different, but it's nice. And there's 
lots of uh, new and exciting things to explore and discover, new adventures to be had. And we're going to be bringing our son into Paris quite often. He's finishing up some schoolwork right now, but as soon as he's done, every single week that he's here, we're going to be going into Paris and having lots of exciting adventures with him, which is going to be really great. And it's only a commuter right away, so it's, uh, it's 12 miles as the crow flies and about 40 minutes by train. So thanks for joining us for today's video, and if you haven't yet subscribed to our channel, be sure to click the red subscribe button below, and we'll see you again in the next video. Bye. Bye.